Hi, on today's episode of Not Wasting Your Time, we're going to have a look at build plate adhesion, more specifically on how you can improve it using your slicing software. As the name suggests, build plate adhesion makes sure that your prints stick to your print bed as well as possible. I'm going to be using Slicer Prusa Edition, but any decent slicing software should have those options available, so you can choose whichever you like. There are generally three options to improve your belt plate adhesion. First one being skirt. Skirt is this line of plastic your printer makes around your printed object. This should unify the flow of plastic from the nozzle and therefore prevent any under extrusion on the first layer and improve the build plate adhesion that way. And the other advantage of using a skirt is that it can help you detect if your bed is not leveled. You can kind of see on the beam of plastic if there are any problems and then you can pause your print and level the bed properly because this could also result in failed print. And the second option is called brim. Brim is pretty similar to skirt, but it touches your part, therefore it helps with the build plate adhesion even more. This is very really useful if you have a print with a lot of tiny features on the first layer or on the bottom of the part. When you use brim, you increase the surface area and it sticks to your heat bed much better. Therefore, it's more powerful than using just skirt. Brim obviously also unifies the flow of plastic before it starts printing your part, so it's useful this way as well. You can obviously choose the surface area you want to cover with the brim. And the third and most powerful option is called raft. Raft is this cushion of plastic, if you will, which is printed underneath your actual object. And the raft obviously sticks to your bed very well because it has a huge surface area, perfect for build plate adhesion. And then when you have a part with, again, a lot of tiny features on the bottom, it's much easier to stick them to your raft, plastic to plastic, than stick them to your build plate. Therefore, this is the most powerful option. I don't use this very often because it increases the print time quite a bit. But when I have some special piece with a lot of tiny features on the bottom, and I'm worried that it wouldn't stick very well to the print bed itself, I'm gonna use raft for this. To recap, the least powerful skirt unifies the flow. Second called brim, this increases the surface area of the bottom of your part. I'm using this very often if I have tiny features on the bottom. And third called raft, the most powerful, makes sure your part is stuck to your bed as well as possible, but it increases the print time quite a bit and uses quite a bit of plastic as well. Thank you very much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, leave them down in the comments and I'm gonna see you next time. Bye!